I'm going to be doing uh, an updated eyebrow tutorial. Um, I know I've updated a couple, but I wanted to share with you a few things to you divas that have uh, probably have issues with their brows and want to get their brows on track. And this is just a simple way that I do my brows and stuff. Y'all excuse me. I am very much sick right now. I'm under the weather. But I'm determined to do what I gotta do for my YouTube subscribers. Um, before I get started, I wanted to share with you what I purchased at Dollar General three days ago. And I bought this new blue eyeliner. It is really pretty. It's called Indigo Blue it's from Wet n Wild. I don't know if you guys can see that. And I got this the other day um, uh, at Dollar General. This is like three bucks. And it's really pretty. I was I will swatch it for you. And then I'm going to do a look from this. It's going to be a simple eye tutorial part after this. See how pretty that blue is? And this here is getting very popular for you ladies seeing I've seen on YouTube um, how they do their liner and when you get out. And what I will do, you can add a darker liner first or you can or add it to make the blue stand out a little bit more if that makes sense. Um, before I get started, I wanted to just share with you um, just a basic eye tutorial and I'm going to get some of my products so I'd like to share with you how I do how I get my brows uh, the way they look okay I'm going to have my concealer palette this is to help with any um, shaping my brows Okay, sorry about that, guys. I was uh, looking for my brushes here. Sorry about that. I am all over the place. I've got my concealer brush, and also got another concealer that I'm going to use for highlighting my eyes. Um, I got my angle brush. I got my palette, Morph palette. I'm going to use the black from this palette here. And I'm just going to how I do my brows. Um, I do have a brush to brush them, but I don't know where they're at at this time. But I also use a brow gel. It's a clear gel, but it was clear, but I've been using it. So, um, yeah, I did a client's makeup the other day. I'll put a few pictures in the video so you guys can see that I did her makeup. I wasn't going to record it, but it was just a little bit of time and span and trying to get her brows done because she had to be somewhere. But I did take a, pic a few pictures of her brows. I'm just going to add the gel and let it dry on my uh, brows so that I can you know, get them shaped. And um, the easy way, if you're just uh, a person like myself who gets them waxed once a month or, you know, however you want to do it. And I just recently had them waxed, I'll say about two, three weeks ago. And they're still looking pretty decent. The lady did a pretty good job. I went to a new place, my friend and I went to get our eyebrows done. Now, I'm just going to let it dry a little bit, keep it dry. I'm just going to add a little of this black uh, from the palette. And I'm just going to trace. I don't know if you guys can see. Trace. And even. If you mess up, that's okay. You can fix it. I'm going to have to pick up some makeup wipes today. And just draw. Get it even on your brow. And 
Okay, get it. And go. Right here. It's time to freshen it up. And get it. And I'm just brief, just, you know, filling in the filling in a little bit more. Giving it the shape. And do the same thing. Left the right. Yeah, I'm trying to get this one right. And it's like... Do it one day and it'll be good, and next day it'll be horrible. <laughs> and I'm just gonna shake that up with my concealer. And I'm just gonna take uh, my concealer here from Cos uh, BH Cosmetics, and I'm just gonna clean it up real good. And I'm using maybe a lighter concealer here to run on my brows. You can just clean them up. Like I said, everything is not going to always be perfect, but you're going to do, keep practicing at it, and you'll get it. Me specifically, since I've been, been sick, <laughs> things are not going to come out like they're supposed to today, because I'm taking medication to try to get the pain to go away, because I have to deal with my toddler, who's at home with me, and, you know, got to go out and pay a bill, and get back on track with things and it's just been hard for me so I apologize to you ladies and I'm just cleaning it up and don't worry about how they look they might look you know out of proportion and everything with, like I said practice make perfect right I'm just gonna go back in the brow and with it some more. And I have five brows, so it'll be more even for me. Okay, now I'll just clean it up. Bring it down some. I don't want it to be all uneven. And I always get where your eye meets your, your line meets your eye right here. So that's where you want your line to um, be, at, okay? And um, I saw a video as well. A young lady was doing her brows. And she was showing us how to properly line your tail up with your, meet your to meet your eye. I'm just gonna blend out the concealer. So you ladies can see the difference. And I will try to do a tutorial on the blue eyeliner and share with you ladies just a natural look with but just a liner. Okay, if you just want and like myself, I'm just wearing a wig. <laughs> I just threw it on, didn't feel good. Everything, yeah, it's getting some of the gel that I'm gonna apply to the brows. And this also helps shape. Clean that up as well.
Yeah. Now, this is what I do to get my brows. The best way I know how I'm just add it. Highlight. And this is the highlighter I use. Excuse me, guys. Um, to and my brows highlighted here. I hope this tutorial kind of helps you guys some. And don't worry because I'm going to have my, my foundation on. I've already washed my face and I'm going to apply a little bit of the cream that I've been using. This is the long, uh, day long cream. This is here just to help um, get the dry spots on my face because I have issues with um, mainly in here. And I just kind of blend it out in my neck. Make sure you blend it in well. Like I said, a neck cream really helps a lot with dry skin. Um, I just kind of avoid putting it around my brows. <laughs> I just use the places where it's dry and that's to help with makeup as well. I use a primer, but mainly I just use keep my moisturizer to help me get my makeup on because it does really, really work with your makeup. And it doesn't, your makeup doesn't dry out. It's much because you know weather here is crazy and I'll have a better hair wig I had this wig for some time I don't forgot the name to it but um she's a uh she don't have comb she leaves just a regular full cap wig real pretty wig I just gotta get her right she's been in um closet for some time um yeah she was a little tangled up so I had to kind of brush her down and yeah let's just get our brows in order here And I hope you guys um, like this tutorial. And if, I, if you have any questions, please feel free to comment below and let me know what you guys think. And I uh, thank you guys for watching. Have a blessed week. And I'll be back with some tutorials. Um, right now, my medication is helping me a little bit. and uh, so, But I'm still a little groggy from it because I'm just so tired. And I'm praying that the pain don't come back because it comes back out of nowhere. And it's all on my one side. And I do have bad teeth. I've always had bad teeth ever since I was a little girl. It was a genetic thing in my family. And I've been trying to work on getting them done. But these folks up here want to charge you an arm and a damn leg. And insurance may help a little, but it doesn't help a lot. And my insurance don't do all that. It only covers like 80% of my work. And if I need to have all my teeth removed, which I have to have them all removed at this time. Since they're all bad at this time. I don't show you guys because... There's some evil people in this world. I don't want to do that. And I don't have time for the judgment. Because it's not their place to judge. It's God's place. And God knows my situation. The majority of you guys know. But I'm not going to sit here and dwell on it. I know God is going to take care of me. And I keep faith in Him. And I know that in due time I'll have something better. So y'all have a blessed day. And I'll talk to you soon. Please don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Thumbs up. And thank you guys. Be blessed. Bye-bye.